I should have never asked him to come down, man. He's bad for business. You think that's bad for business? I've been stealing money for months. <laughs> Brad. <clears throat> Brad. Hey, man. Why are you working so hard? You should be enjoying your retirement, you know? Yeah, there's still plenty to do here. The hinge on that office door is busted, the window needs caulking, and that back room is such a mess, you got a bunch of weeds growing in there. <laughs> Look, man, why don't you just call it a day, you know? You're retired, it's two o'clock. Hey, it's almost dinner time. <laughs> Are you kicking me out? No, you know. Yeah. <laughs> Look, what? Why don't you just go home? I don't believe this. Hyde, I don't get it. We're gonna destroy Mr. Foreman's house, and that's supposed to make him feel better? Yeah. <laughs> then he can fix everything and it'll feel really useful. Red will be happier in the time he chased off those deadheads camping in the park. Well, you can't camp there, man. Some bald guy chases you off. I just ripped this right off the furnace. I busted that TV. I totally destroyed the washing machine, man. Oh, hey, Red. I'm glad you're here, man. Things are just falling apart down here. It's freezing in my room, the TV's broken, and this thing just popped right out of the washing machine. Geez, I'm gone for one day, the whole house goes to hell. Yeah, it's a good thing you're here, though, so you can fix everything. You know what? I'll get to this stuff later. Later? Yeah, I was thinking about what you said this afternoon at the record store. You're right. I do deserve to slow down and enjoy my retirement. So. Right now, I'm going fishing. Yeah, it's like 10 degrees in my room. Can I at least call a repairman? Sure, but you're paying for it. I'm on a fixed income. I'm retired. This is bad. We destroyed everything. On the bright side, I don't live here. What am I gonna do, man? I can't watch TV, I can't sleep in my room. Guess I can drag my bed out here. Hi, right, man. Where do you see what I did to your bed? All right, well, look. I mean, if you really like him, you're gonna have to tell him. I know. You're right. You're right. All right. Hey. 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 So, uh, here you like Fess. What? But how did you hear that? Since we weren't trapped in a soundproof lead box, we were able to hear your delicate voice from across the street. All right, okay, I know you guys probably think I'm crazy and I'm going from guy to guy, but Fez has always been there for me and he makes me feel good about myself. So go ahead, go, go make fun of me. No, oh, man, that's cool. You know, Fez is a good guy. I think if he'd make you happy, that's what you should do. Wow, Steven thinks. And if it doesn't work out, I hear Bob's available. <laughs> I should have never asked him to come down, man. He's bad for business. You think that's bad for business? I've been stealing money for months. <laughs> Red. <clears throat> Red. Hey, man, why are you working so hard? You should be enjoying your retirement, you know? Yeah, there's still plenty to do here. The hinge on that office door is busted, the window needs caulking, and that back room is such a mess, you got a bunch of weeds growing in there. <laughs> Look, man, why don't you just call it a day, you know? You're retired, it's two o'clock. Hey, it's almost dinner time. Are you kicking me out? No. You know. 
Yeah. <laughs> Look, what? Why don't you just go home? I don't believe this. Hyde, I don't get it. We're gonna destroy Mr. 